you doing? So today I was trying to do two lives from uh, the police station. I'd gone there to lodge a complaint and they'd keep on making my lives vanish. Okay. So I thought that I'll come back home and I'm going to record my vlogs as I do every day. And I want to get to the deeper truths as far as yesterday's assault was concerned. Um, the whole deal is that I have noticed a couple of patterns which I need to be crystal clear about. Now, they all have put a gin in me that you all know to control me and to use my body to satiate their own lust and the lust of their circle of friends. This gin has obviously been put by Shatrugan Sena and his family or by somebody in Salman Khan's family, straight up. Now, everybody suspects it to be Shatrugan Sena because he's raped me. Everybody knows that in Delhi and they've tried their best to gag me on this one. Even Sohil Khan has taken advantage of me and that he's not the only one. Shatrugan Sena has literally sold my body in that possessed uh, Rukia state, you know, wherein I'm unconscious to Timi Narang, Jimmy Narang, VN Dhut, Andrit Dhut, everybody. And he's filled his pockets and gotten favors and furthered his daughter's career. All right. That is also something that is not unknown. So basically, he wants me to be trapped in the sex scam that he's running through black magic. He doesn't want me to go out there and date new men or have any consensual conscious sex. All right. Now, I've been tied up with Salman Khan through Washi Karan for years now. It's been nine years now. When I message the bastard, he doesn't reply to my message. When I tell that bastard, you come and meet me in Pune, he will not come. He just enjoys making me crave for him because he and Sonakshi and his brothers can have a good laugh at a groveling puja. When you guys know what a self-respecting, innocent, simple kind of a person I am, hardly horny compared to how horny Sonakshi, Sena and Malaika have behaved in the past. Now let me trace it down to how horny Sonakshi, Sena has behaved. You all clearly remember that in Big Boss, somebody had raped me. I'd got a love bite on my collarbone. Everybody suspects it to be um, Sky. Because he was a horny bastard who was saying also that I'm not getting drugs, I'm not getting sex, I'm feeling out of place, I feel like I, I'll die. So I won't be surprised it was Sky who raped me inside Big Boss's house. So the bitch goes and I, when I say in the press conference that I got a love bite here on my collarbone, she goes and she gets a tattoo done here. Why? Again, to sexually bottle me up and to oppress me. So that the attention of the rapist goes to her and doesn't come to me. Imagine ek rapist ke attention ke liye bhi ye log bhooke hain ki Pooja Mishra ko kaise kaal kotri mein band karke rakhna chahiye. Alright? So that you've seen. You've seen that whenever a guy is attracted to me or gives me some vibes, so Nakshi will go and start rubbing her tits on his face, you know, and try to attract him towards herself. So it is basically Sonakshi and Shatrugan who want me to be a slave to the person who's put a gin in me. It's like as though they've been paid for it or they've picked up some beera. You say, bolte na, beten uthaya hai, beera uthaya hai. Beera uthaya hai ki puja mishra ki sex life ko suffocate karke rakhna hai. We don't have to let her meet any new guy. We don't have to let her get married. Imagine it's been so many years. I walked into that fuck hole in 2005 May. Videocon guest house. We are in 2019 now. So many years I've not been able to find a boyfriend, a steady relationship or been engaged or gotten married. Obviously there are some things at play. You know and today I'm here to make the invisible visible. Enough is truly enough. So when I used to be in the Vidicon guest house, obviously uh, Shatrugan Sinha was sitting on my head along with Sohail Khan and Salim Khan and they all were putting jeans in me and using me as a toy. So Nakshi Sinha hacked my phone, Arbaz Khan hacked my phone, Timi Narang hacked my phone. I have a guarantee of that. They kept on stealing my work and giving it to Malaika. Malaika also hacked my phone. They kept on stealing my shows, my work and giving it to Malaika and to Sonakshi to uh, thicken their bond with each other. I was just a ladder. Just a toy to be used to thicken their bond and increase their bank balance and make their life more luxurious. I've had people tell me from Viscraft that Malaika has literally given standing instructions along with Salman Khan and Sohail Khan that Pooja Mishra will not be called for IFA. So has Shatrugan Sena and Sonakshi Sena left these kind of instructions. Do you guys know of bigger parasites who clutched me in 2005? And now it's going to be 2019 and they still think they can continue with this bullshit. That guy Afroz who I met in Multifit gym was either planted there by Love and Kush 
or he was planted there by Sohail Khan considering he was also a Muslim. Either of the two, okay? And he is telling me, let's go out. We go out. The moment I post pictures with him and a video with him on Instagram, suddenly his father calls him and says, you come back home right away. What was that if not black magic and gin set play? And they drug me in the drink. They bloody assault me outside my house because they can't handle my attitude in my vlogs because I'm finally being myself, the girl I was before I entered that brothel in 2005. I'm going to have my attitude. I'm going to be myself. No one can stop me from being myself anymore. And if they're going to assault me, they're going to have a police complaint against them. And I've got the police complaint here with me. I'm going to read it out to you. I have a receiving. Tomorrow I'm going for my medicals, for my nose and my injuries, for all you shits. Do you know Bala, that bastard in Bombay? I told you I saw Sonakshi under his billing. You know what messages he sent me on WhatsApp this morning? Why are you doing this fake drama with ketchup sauce? You bloody old bastard. The day your dick breaks and you bleed like that, na? then you will know the pain of bleeding so profusely. I was bleeding so hard. My mother saying outside, when I might have uh, come inside my house, I have the house keys. She saying, chair pe khun laga hua tha. Kyunki tum chabi nikal rahi hogi andar aane ke liye. My brother saying, wall pe pura khun laga hua tha. You are bleeding so profusely the way Papa used to bleed. Okay? And these people are making it a joke. Catch up in this that. Well, here the police complaint. To the SHO Mundwa. Dear ma'am, I, Pooja Mishra, met a man named Afro Sheikh who walked up to me and started talking to me at Multifit Gym and taking selfie pictures. He claimed to be a cricketer who runs a cricketing academy in Pune. His number is 9762743117. Please dial him, guys. Please dial him and interrogate him. He was by purpose positioned at Multifit Gym by Lavsina or Sohail Khan. On Saturday night, Afro Sheikh took me to Carnival Restaurant in Mundwa, where I had been two Saturdays earlier with another friend of mine called Bhushan. They mixed drugs in my picture of Sangria. Who did it? Number one suspect, Kush Sena, the stalker who's been stalking me for 15 years, robbed 35 movies of me and gave it to Salman Khan's circle of girlfriends just to lick his ass and butter his toes so that he continues to make... Dabang with, uh, with uh, Sonakshi Sinha as the main lead heroine. Suspect number two. Or either the drink was spiked by Afro Sheikh himself. After one glass of sangria, I posted some pictures and videos on my social media, namely Instagram. Immediately, Afro got a call from his father asking him to leave. We immediately walked out of Carnival Restaurant. No rickshaw was ready to take me back home. And I, and don't you think it was Afro's Sheikh's duty to drop me home so late at night? But he was not bothered as he was with Shatrugan Sinha and his son in the plan to assault me. So if Afro's Sheikh was sent by Sohail Khan, so Sohail Khan is as much a party in this whole conspiracy to have assaulted me day before yesterday night. I sat in a rickshaw outside Carnival and left for my home. But as the rickshaw wala was a terrorist looking mullah, Muslim with a dadhi, he kept misbehaving with me. All thanks to the jinns that Shatrugan Sena has left on me, which go into the rickshaw wala and then they keep misbehaving with me. They, took, they take over the rickshaw wala's mind, the jinns. This rickshaw wala got me till the police station. I got out of his rickshaw. And with the help of some policemen, found another rickshaw to go back home. On reaching my bungalow, I got out of the rickshaw after paying him. And Sonakshi Sinha's family had planted a man outside my gate who knew I had been drugged in my drink at carnival and was out of sorts. He pushed me so badly from behind that my nose kept bleeding the whole night. As well as my knees were injured badly. No one other than Sonakshi and her family could have assaulted me. As I live in two layers of security in the exclusive bungalow area. Where my father had helped Shatrugan get a bungalow too. He's my neighbor. He lives 10 steps away from me. So only someone from Shatrugan Sinha's family can access that exclusive bungalow area 
as love sina kept stalking me everywhere i go and has stolen 35 movies by stalking and hacking my phone along with uh, uh, certain members of salman khan's family like sohail khan malaika arbaz i need you to uh, do a thorough investigation of this case and imprison love sina and shatrughan sina who have been raping me and circulating me in their circle of friends in an unconscious state to get money and favors from them example salman khan vn dhut timmy and jimmy narang and god knows how many more i need you to lodge an fir and issue an arrest warrant again sinna and khan thanking you pooja mishra so this was the complaint i lodged and i tried to do a live three times on pooja mishra products from the police station but they was, used to keep on making the live disappear i can record the same thing on youtube you can't stop me if i want to say something i will say it when you've done some wrong it will be heard because enough of your fucking around enough of you bastards playing around with my life okay now i'm going to quickly get into your questions and one more thing vinit jain vinit jain this is a straight challenge and this is a straight strict warning to you you know very well my nose was bleeding i was posting it all over instagram after that You know very well I subscribe to your paper Times of India in Pune. You've had the audacity to publish Sanakshi Sinha's picture. I'm going to sue you. In 2011, I paid you 65,000 per month for a media net contract of six months. You broke that media net contract unceremoniously without giving me any reasons. In fact, you are yet to refund me 65,000 rupees. So don't you dare try these stunts of hiding the criminals. By publishing that pictures and unki shan badha rahe ho tum, jab wo meri naak tod rahe, tum se zada harami aur do muha saap media me maine dekha nahi hai. Media is supposed to influence public at large, and what is the message you are sending? That break Pooja Mishra's nose, break Pooja Mishra's knees, and make Sunakshi Sinha the criminal be published in your papers and make her out to be the heroine. Enough! Enough! I will sue you in High Court for that uh, termination, unprofessional, unceremonious termination of my 2011 media net contract with Times of India. You watch it with me, Vinny Jain. I have have access up till your mother, who is the real signatory authority of Times of India, not you. So stay within your seams. Enough! Hi Pooja. Glad you are well. I'm not well, you know. I'm really tired. I can hardly walk. I'm still very weak. Hey Pooja, looking beautiful. Thank you. Nice makeup, Pooja. Thank you. Has your mother started supporting you? Nice to see her photo yesterday. Well, she is blow hot, blow cold. Right now, you didn't uh, hear her screaming from behind. Whenever I say anything again, Shatrughan Sinha, so Nakshi Sinha, the spell on her starts making her scream. So she is the slave, basically. This cheapo Sazan Khan was making rounds outside the same police station. How can he make rounds? I'm in Pune. I'm in Pune. Okay. I'm not in Mumbai. who is the guy who was shouting when he posted the video why was he shouting so much does he not understand your pain it was my brother actually and he was saying that uh, you need a doctor stop making videos go to a doctor we need to get you a doctor so he was just concerned and he only took care of me my nose was bleeding my whole track pants my sports bra my walls the chair outside where i sit to take out my house keys when i uh, come inside after a late night all drenched in my blood okay I like the eye shadow matching the lipstick very elegant thank you I've kept the lipstick color ready for you guys because you all always ask me it is zipper it's zipper can you see it 
zipper. I heard that people were harassing you by adding you to group chats. How dare they? That's how I've gotten out of all the group chats. I don't want to be a part of your group if you're a fucking cesspool, incestuous pool that they won't let me get out of. Why should you face all this? Just tell me, why should I face all this? What's my fault that I'm rebelling against being a part of a cesspool? Where the father's fucking his daughter, the mother's fucking Salman Khan, along with uh, making me lie down as naked as a toy, as a bait. Poonam Sena can't get Salman Khan's cock, so she makes a nubile virgin lie down in the middle naked as a bait. Where Shatrugan Sena fucks girls his daughter's age and doesn't let her go out there and date or get married. I refuse to be a part of such a cesspool. Did the police support you? What was their initial response? Their initial response was okay. They took the complaint. They gave me a receiving. And tomorrow I have to go for my medicals. You know, I have to go and get the whole under say nose ka checkup, get my knee injury, everything on uh, police records. And I lodged the complaint. So they will go to carnival and they'll call up this afros and do the checkup. Pooja, do Shatru and Timmy have pictures together? Is there some connection? Timmy who? Sohail you're talking about or Timmy Narang you're talking about? Come on, enough of these games, okay? Afroz is a Muslim. He could have been sent here by Sohail Khan. Think about it. Timmy Narang, who Timmy Narang? I don't know any Timmy Narang. I haven't seen him in years. I haven't seen him since 2009. And yes, they do have pictures together because Timmy Narang had thrown a party in his honor. They do have pictures together in the same party. Pooja, I felt so bad after seeing your blood. My mom also felt bad. Good to see you in good health. All Sinha bastards will suffer. Pooja, they wanted to make you a pauper while they get all the luxuries of the world. That's how they put the gin. That's how they put the gin. Everywhere, I'm forever promoting Salman Khan and this, that. So for all you know, Salman Khan's father has put the gin in me. Or Malaika has put the gin. Or Sohail has put the gin. Because all the bounties of my hard work has gone to them. Either Sina was sitting in the middle doing all this or Salman Khan's family was doing so directly. Highly possible. Because today I'll spare nobody. When I have to suffer physical ailments, has Salman Khan messaged me and asked, baby, are you okay? Has he walked into my house and given me a hug and said that, are you alright, my darling? Because he doesn't like me. He is jealous of me. He is jealous of me. He is jealous of me. And I keep on praising him and I keep on saving him and I keep on, uh, you know, justifying all his wrongdoings to me. But the fact remains, Salman Khan is jealous of me. Pooja, did Afros contact you again? Yes, he contacted me again and I've recorded that call and I've sent it to Dushyant also, my friend here. And in that he was just saying, I got scared, I got scared. What you got scared? You were a part of the conspiracy. It was your conspiracy that how dare Pooja speak up in her vlogs against us. So you all assaulted me. So what? You got scared. When the police will hit you by dandas on the soles of your feet, then you'll have to confess the conspiracy, you fucking bastard. Pooja, isn't he, uh, isn't it fishy how he left the date suddenly? Of course. Waiting for your house tour. Well, the junk hasn't been removed as yet. So I can't give it to you just yet. Pooja, how was your date going with that afros until he got the call? Was he sane? Did you notice anything weird? Well, actually, you know, we went and we sat on the table and there was only one candlelight. So I requested the management. Can you please switch on the torches of your phone? I want to click pictures. And even he was very excited about clicking pictures with me because I think he might be following me online on my Instagram. So one waiter was, had uh, switched on his torch from this side. One waiter had switched on his torch from that side. We made that video, remember? Na, 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 wala. And we posted it. Then after that, I called for the picture of Sangria, which I'd had with Bhushan also two weeks back. Remember that guy, my friend, who I went to watch Butler House with? 
who has a car, who's got class, not like this lapanga, some musalta lapanga from the gym, vagabond. So um, I ordered the sangria. Last time I had had four glasses of sangria. Okay, this time I hadn't even finished one glass. So they poured the first glass of sangria, and we clicked another picture. The moment I posted the picture, means I've not even finished half a glass of sangria. This Afros gets a call on his phone. Pooja, it's my dad. He says his uncle is dead. We have to drive to Kolapur. Have to go. So I said okay. So we got up. The drinks were lying there, and we started moving towards the door. But in that one glass of sangria, either the Safros or the management of Carnival, which again could be Love Sina, who's been stalking me for fifteen years now, had already mixed the drug, and this is the drug they've used many a times with me. I told you it's a gang rape drug which erases the memory of the night from your psyche altogether. Their mission was accomplished. They had drugged Pooja Mishra and made her delirious. Then all the drama with the rickshaw wala, thanks to the Jinjin Nath, Salim Khan, and Chaturgan Sena, I've left on me. Then I reach Munwa Police Station. I exchange another rickshaw. I come back home. The moment I come back home, they've planted a man there to push me so hard. He literally pushed me from behind. जो आपने बहुत सारी mythological war films में देखा होगा, पीठ पे खंजर मारना बोलते हैं इसे हिंदी में, backstabbing. और कायर पीठ पे ही वार करते हैं ये एक हजारों में एक दिलेर पूजा मिश्रा मिलेगी जो मुंह पे सच बोलने का दम रखती है इरिस्पेक्टिव ऑफ द कॉन्सिक्वेंसेस कायर की तरह पीछे पीछे एक आदमी रोक रखा था मेरे गेट के बाहर थार से उसने मेरा सर जमीन पे मारा एंड आई फेल ऑन माय फेस माय नोज एंड द फ्रंट ऑफ माई नी वो बैडली इंजर्ड and my nose was bleeding like the bleeding will not stop afros did something for sure he's a pet dog of either sinna or khan 100% 100% he is very fishy the bloody lapanga doesn't even have a car bloody bhikkari no etiquettes that you should drop a girl back home after uh, going out with her please 100% and i'm going to narrate one more incident yeah one more incident like this i'll narrate to you udit narayan son's birthday i'm going to narrate the incident let me first finish reading all your uh, comments pooja how do you know bala and you had said your mom hates bala tell us why see basically i met bala at the uh, you know uh, jaipur lit fest had an opening night at the royal opera in mumbai now i used to take courses from this company which was hosting this opening of jaipur lit fest this is last year so i drove all the way from pune just for the opening of jaipur lit fest i met my old friends william darampal and all these people who i've met and hung out with in the past and there i met bala and bala is this old hag wanna be pimp kind of a person scrawny weather beaten pimp you know trying to suck up to all the beautiful women because if he stands in their company he'll get bhav from financiers and well connected men he's that kind of a pimpish person pooja is bala also sunakshi spy highly possible when i was forced into bdd chal and i had gone to bala's house i had gone to pick up some stuff and give him some breakfast because he's given me breakfast many a times in his house so i thought i'll just return the favor and i landed up having a big fight with him and i walked down and i saw sonakshi below his building so i think bala is under complete influence of sonakshi sena 100% he sonakshi sena spy Uja, did you tell Afros Sheikh how Sanakshi used to do black magic? What was his reaction to it? No, I didn't tell him anything. I don't know him for long enough to tell him all that. I just told him that I'll mail you my biography. You go through it. You'll get to know my history. I don't want to talk about my past. I'm here to enjoy, have a glass of sangria, you know, share a couple of laughs, enjoy, feel light-hearted. So I don't want to talk about my past. Uja, I think your vlogs. are killing your competitors that's what even i think gaand mar do sona aksa ki pooja and that lande chila musalta 
लंडछिला मुसलटा तो मुझे उसका बाप ही लगता है शत्रुघ्न क्योंकि इतनी गांडूगिरी वही करेगा सिर्फ एक पॉलिटिशियन हु थिंक्स ही कैन गेट अवे विद इट एंड इफ सुहेल खान इज इन्वॉल्व एंड इवन ही विल बी फकिंग स्ट्रिप नेकेड एंड बुचर्ड अलाइव मेरा हराम का सुहेल खान कम खा के बैठा है शूटिंग इन अनिल शिव लेकर गोल्फ कॉस हुज माई फादर्स कॉन्टैक्ट वे इज माई मेन लीड फिल्म वाई वॉज एन आई टेक इन मेन लीड एज एज अ मेन लीड इन फिकी अली वॉट्स विद द बैरियर बिकॉज द बैरियर से ना आई गोट ब्रेक दैट बैरियर टूडे Enough! Exploited me 360 degrees in 15 years. Wreck my love life. Wreck my sex life. Rape me. Prostituted me. Rob 35 movies of me. Enough! Tell us more about the misbehavior you faced by the rickshaw wala. What did he do? Why did you have to take him to the police station? See, basically, he kept on saying something, something. You know, मैं पांच सौ रुपए लूँगा and this that. I said, भाई भैया meter से जितना होता है उतना लो. Then he was driving. He was jumping on the speed breakers. I said, भाई साहब आराम से drive करिए. रात का time है. मैं अकेली लड़की हूँ. Please आराम से drive करिए. He's jumping the speed breakers and driving so rashly. ऐसे 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 ऐसे. I said, stop it. He dropped me to another rickshaw. Otherwise, I'm calling the police. So he said, "You police, what will you do? I will take the police station and take it." I said, "Come on." And that's how we landed up at the police station. Where is the scar? Which scar? Which scar? The wound is inside here. This cartridge of the nose has been uh, uh, injured. Can't you see my nose has become double the size? How how swollen up is my this part of the nose, the bulbous? How swollen up is my bulbous? Tomorrow I'll get the medical certificates also to slap on you fucking fuckers faces who have come with fake IDs. So Nakshi Sena ki mood ke kille. Hot enough. Did the rickshaw wala manage to uh, get a glimpse of the man who pushed you? As soon as I got down and the rickshaw wala drove off, then he attacked me from behind. Did you see how this Sanakshi is suddenly talking about rickshaw walas and the bang in her interview? Hundred percent, it is her family who has assaulted me. It's Sanakshi Sena and her father and her fagda Hawaro brothers who nobody even cares to fart on, who've got nothing better to do in life, who've mooched thirty-five movies of me, who've done this. They have got a bungalow next to me. I live in an exclusive double layer of security. Only somebody who lives next door can do this. It is Sanakshi Sena and her brothers. Sena, Pooja, Sanakshi ka to kuch karna padega. Pani sir se upar nikal gaya hai. Movies to uski koi chal rahi nahi hai. That's why she's frustrated. Par mera kya un log ne hal bana rakha hai? Uski movies nahi chali, wo kabi nahi chalengi. आप किसी की कबर पे अपना आलीशान स्टारडम का बंगला चलाने चले कभी नहीं बन पाएगा आगे की भी पिक्चरें फ्लॉप हो गया और दबंग थ्री तो रिलीज ही नहीं हो गया अगर खुदा ना खासता रिलीज हो गई वो चलने वाली है नहीं पिक्चर चाहे ये लोग कोई भी आ, ट्रिक ट्राई कर ले किसी का नाक तोड़ के किसी का यहां पर फाड़ के आप पिक्चर बनाने चले हो अपनी बेटी को आगे करने चले हो तो खाओगे उल्टे हाथ का And of course, she might be frustrated that her movies are not a hit. But first, tell her to go and cleanse her karma, na. Jitte aur pop karogi, utti aur picture flop hongi. It's the rule of the universe. What goes around comes around. What you sow is what you reap. Misguiding me, Malika did it. This did it. That did it. I mean, enough. It is all Sonakshi Sena, Shatrugan Sena, Love and Kosh, and yes, to certain degree, Malika, Sohail, and Salman too. Full stop. This is the truth. I feel they don't want the lives to be seen. Pretty evident.
Why is your mom screaming again and again? She had become nice, hadn't she? Whenever I say anything against Sonakshi Sinha or Shatrugan Sinha, she starts screaming. Only them. If I say anything against Salman Khan, no problem. If I say anything against Shah Rukh Khan, no problem. So isn't it obvious it's Sinha who's done black magic on my mother? Chupojama. Is Vinny Jain again publicizing uh, Sonakshi Puja? Yes, he is. Today I've woken up to a swollen, painful nose. I couldn't talk. The pain was coming up until here. My knees have been limping like Timur the lame the whole day today. And I wake up to her being publicized by Vinny Jain. So Vinny Jain will also get a tight slap on his face. Enough! Jesus will break her nose. Don't you worry. This is the second time they have done this to me, guys. Second time. I told you first time when Salman had uh, thrown a uh, party in her honor. And this is the second time. Uja Sanakshi seems to be flying high again after getting you punched so badly. Seems like that. It seemed like that by seeing a picture in the paper. That she assaulted me and after that she's publishing a picture ki means chori or phir uske baad sina zori. You know what I'm saying? Enough! Take Sonakshi Sena and thrash her face into Gobar for having ruined your life for 15 years. Yeah, and now it's all coming out on social media. Like your makeup today. Okay, come, I'll make you see it up close. Can you see it? It's a beautiful champagne mauve. Did you guys like my uh, nail tutorial? See my nails? Like it? Love this color. It's like, you know, this gray-purple combo. Looks so sexy. The first index finger is ombre, you know, ombre with glitter. Second is normal. Third is a slant with a glitter line. Fourth is normal and fifth is normal. I love this color. It's such a winter autumn color which people used to wear in the UK and it's trending. I love this color. Love it. Take care, dear. Show us the nail pen, please. Here you go. Can you see it? You can see it on YouTube. I put up the whole uh, nail art tutorial with the color shade and the name and the make. Everything's there. Ma bhi possess ho gai. Haan, jaise hi sinna ka naam lo, wo bhi possess ho jati hai. Spell dal rakha hai na, sabko apna gulam bana ke rakha hai. Spell bound. Yes, darling. 100%. You're not in Mumbai right now? No, I'm not. Uja, any plans to going back to Mumbai? They want you to be caged in Pune. Well, yeah, I'm going to go to the High Court to lodge the case. I will be going. Why can't we see any scar on the nose? See, the wound is inside here. Can you see? It hurts like anything. The wound is here. I fell on my nose like this. You see? Fell on the nose like this. So this cartridge has been wounded. It's an internal bleeding wound, which is even more scary. It's an internal wound. Good to know your brother is being nice. Do jinns manipulate him too at times? Of course. Remember when I was going to lodge the gang rape case? He came and he broke my hand. He was possessed by a jinn. That's why they've left all these jinns swimming around my house. You know? So that they can control me. Because they know that they have wrecked my life. Uja, in one life, you had said Bala could be very kind. Also, he plays mind games with you. Yes, he does. Bala is a bastard. 
Pala's a bastard and I realized that today. I'm going to actually show you his message. When I read it, I just blocked him. I said, I think Sonakshi is going and sucking his cock. And this bastard, what would he know of pain? You know, he sent such a nasty message to me this morning on WhatsApp. What a bastard. What a complete bastard. I think I might have deleted him also because I was very angry. Reading that message, I blocked him and I deleted the chat. You know, I usually do that whenever anybody pisses me off. Just see, what a bastard. Can you read this? See, see the last message. Can you read it? I'll read it out. I've heard of getting egg on your face. How did you get sauce on yours? Can you see the last message with the video? What a bastard, Bala. See, what a swine. And these are my friends who all, I go and find out in the market. I go at events and make friends. And then Sanakshi just goes and spreads a cunt to them. And their loyalty start going towards the person who's more famous and has more money and clout. For how long will she keep on bullying me like this and oppressing me sexually like this? This is what Mehek was doing on Big Boss, na? Whichever friend I made, she started pulling the friend towards her side. I'm to Salman Khan. Ki beji hui hu. Mere paas hao. Pooja Mishra se kyun baat karte ho? She did this or not? Same thing Sonakshi is doing. Pooja, any plans to going back to Mumbai? They want you to be caged in Pune. I'm planning, darling. I'm planning. I'll let you guys know when I plan to go. That blood, blood was fake, yeah. Wait till that blood starts dripping out of your genitals once I castrate you. And you feel the pain of it bleeding out. Then you'll know how fake it was, you fucking bastard. See, I'll show you the blood on the wall. Can you see this, guys? Can you see this? This was the blood on the wall. Can you see the blood? That's the blood from the other night, which is on the wall still. And these fucking two paisa sonakshi sena ke bheje hoye kutte. Ya jiski bhi lund sonakshi sena chusti ya uske bheje hoye kutte mujhe kya bol rahe. Bloody bastards. Take care, dear. Then why were you sleeping for these years? Because I was under the spell of the Jinnad. Try getting a, a khabiz into you for 15 years, then you will know why I was sleeping. The jinns make you blind. It's only after I've started taking Rukia therapy that I can see a little clearer. The jinns had blinded me. They just wanted to use my body and my hard work to become stars themselves. Understand? They were manipulating me by the jinns. They kept on terminating my media contracts. Yesterday I read out what expensive media deals and so many of them. They terminated it and they blinded me by the jinns and they kept on devouring me sexually and prostituting me. I was blinded by the jinns. Ever since I've started taking Rukia, I can see a lot more clearly. The group chats are symbolic to the cesspool Sonakshi has made you forcibly a part of. 100%. Have you tried out Live Me app and You Now app? No, I don't know. Please send me the uh, uh, their link in my direct message. I've never heard of these apps. 
I'm not feeling too well. People ask me, how am I feeling? I'm not feeling too well at all. I'm feeling so drained. When is your next Rukia Puja? Please be careful of these guys and food especially. These people are evil. Yes. I'm going to, once I come to Bombay, I'm going to go for my next Rukia session. I'm just glad I'm not the only one here. This is so addictive. What is? I think this is all karma from that poor little trash bin that you kicked by mistake. <laughs> Very funny. I don't have to suffer such huge bleedings and fractures and whatnot for kicking a bin you know like really and if it was so then I'll keep kicking it let me see how you stop me why can't you remove the gin because darling each time I remove the gin they keep on putting more of them in me you know they keep on putting more. I keep on removing, they keep on putting more. So Muslim can only be sent by a Muslim. Ha ha ha. Fuck your logic. I'm just saying. In all probabilities, it was love and kush. Because they are the ones who stalk me. That afros was sent by my stalker. Which in all probabilities is love, kush and poonam sinna. Because they are shitting bricks. Because now I started revealing a lot about their crimes on my lives. And the whole conspiracy and how they uh, hooked people into their spider web to bully me. Understand? Pooja baby girl. Pooja, are you going to be a guest on the new Big Boss or are you going to watch it? Well, I don't know. If they pay me well and they treat me well, I'd like to come back because that's where my audience is. They still message me. They still want to talk to me. They still uh, search for me. So if I find love there, I will go there. But I need to be treated with respect and I need to be paid handsomely well. Salman should have at least come and met you. Especially after you being punched. But he's a selfish asshole. Just see. After I posted that uh, video, he should have just walked into my house, rang the bell and said, Auntie, I want to meet Pooja. He could have sat here in the living room and just sat with me for 10 minutes. He's not concerned. He's jealous of me. And I've been living in a delusion that he loves me. As much as I'm forced to love him. Do you know what that feels like? How used I feel? I'm bleeding here. They all are seeing my videos on Instagram and they're laughing at me. <laughs> people are trolling Sonakshi on social sites because of her flop movies one after the other I love the passion that goes into these videos not souls in his ass fucking harami afros Tejas Parate says, can you come with me on a date? I probably will if I better get well. That afros looked like a lafanga. You're right. Yeah, he's such a bloody vagabond servant. Doesn't even have a car.
Why did Afros get so scared? Like he said, maybe he got to know. You got to know about him. Yeah, maybe he thought that I'll connect the dots, you know. Although Pooja, let me borrow that glitter eyeliner. I'm dying for it. Inara Hayat says, in your dreams, darling. I'll auction it. You can purchase it. Pooja, take your own sangria wine bottle whenever you go out. Can't trust these low-class bitches. Come sperm, you're absolutely right. And that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to carry my own alcohol if ever I want to go out. What do I drink? I hardly drink. I'm a smoker. I don't drink. But on a Saturday night, I feel like having a Bacardi breezer. Or if I feel like having a sangria, I can buy my own uh, bottle of wine and get some fruit juice and mix it and have it. I don't need to go outside, you know, probably just do it in my own house. You're very right. I will not eat any food from outside. I will not drink anything from outside. I'm surrounded by low class bitches and bastards. Chutha. Do you recognize who that man was? Is he a random man? I couldn't see him. It was so dark and that drug that they had mixed in that one glass of sangria had caught me. I was delirious. My mother said, Beta, you couldn't speak when you came back. Tumse baat nahi kari ja rahi thi. Means you couldn't talk. I had been drugged by that gang rape drugged. They put it in my uh, glass of sangria. That only one glass that I ever had. Pooja, you should carry a rape alarm. Could you send me, DM me a link to where I can purchase it? I'm sure it might be available online. Do you know my mother and my brother sat the whole night, one ice pack from on this side, one ice pack this side and one ice pack here. Then my nose is like this. Please, I'm giving you a close up. Take a screenshot and go back and compare it to my other lives. It's all swollen up from here. And here, I've used a contouring powder. So it's not showing that much. It's totally swollen up. There were three ice packs put on my nose throughout the night to stop the bleeding. The bleeding wasn't stopping. And I don't need to justify to anybody. Tomorrow I'm going to uh, for medicals. I'll have the medical certificate. Bloody Throw it on you bastard's face. Hundred percent. Anyway, Pooja, get help, get well, you'll be okay. Did he offer to pay for the date? Not really. But because he was in such a rush, he landed up paying. We didn't even drink anything. It was all wasted. Pooja, why don't you move out of India? Why did you have a fight with Bala the day... You saw Sonakshi below his house because Sonakshi has hacked my this phone. This phone is hacked by Sonakshi Sinha because it's the queen of coins, the bitch who's been running the sex scam as far as I'm concerned. And she might have, in this, she's hearing everything we are speaking. So she might have heard on this phone that I'm having a fight with him. So she came charging ki chalo. Like how Amar and I in a Big Boss, I vlogged it. The day I broke the broom, later on Amar came to speak to me. Then I didn't want to speak to him because I was getting too drained. So may I grab the opportunity to go and stick with him and get in his good books and score brownie points. Everywhere, all the chalaki and cock hungry moves of Mehek, I can see Sonakshi having done them in my real life. I had a fight with Bala because Bala wasn't helping me with the house. I told him, get me a broker who can get me out of this BDD chal and can help me locate a better house. He didn't want to help. He calls himself the secretary of the broker's association. He's nothing but a chut. You know, all fart, no shit. That's Bala for you. So I had a fight with him because he wasn't helping me get a better place. And so Nakshi was hearing everything from the phone. So the moment I walked down the stairs, she was ready with a lubricated cunt that come fuck me. Bala is such a fucking 
weather beaten ugly looking haggard piece of shit he can't even get it up what will he fuck a bloody rand like this Pooja, I hope you're feeling a little better today. I'm glad you were able to file the report and pamper yourself. I'm still shocked at what has happened for like the millionth time. Pooja, you need to increase security near to your area. Otherwise, this bastard will again do something. Yeah, it's Chatrugan Sinha. 100% is Chatrugan Sinha and his family. And I'm lodging another complaint because I've got an investigation agency which has come and confirmed with me that all the stalking, stealing of your movies, coming on your head, hitting the flush, it was all being done by Sonakshi Sinha and Love Sinha. They were doing it. And their parents are so uh, uh, great that they couldn't tell their children to stay off me. They were also encouraging. They were also encouraging. Because they themselves are frustrated third grade, C grade actors. Uh, Puna was made to lose so many movies and Shatrughan is only known for his villainry. So they were more than happy with Sonakshi and Kush conjuring me and suffocating me and harassing me and stealing my movies. In fact, they went and redirected those movies to Salman Khan's girlfriends. Ki chalo, let's go browning points from Pooja's hard-earned money uh, in Salman Khan's camp. And Arbaaz Khan completely supported them in this. Sina wants to wreck you 360 degrees. He's an auger, 100%. Pooja, ma'am, you should get married with a decent guy. I know that, darling. I know that. I, I'm well aware of that. And the day I do that, Sina's control on me will break. And that's what I need. And he can't control me anymore. That fucking bastard. I'll hit him. Take care, dear. Rickshaw is not good. I know Rickshaw is no better. I know Khan is no better. Ah, bhai. Rickshaw should be banned in Mumbai. Ma'am, love your eyeshadow. Which shade and brand? It's Sivan. It's Sivana. Col uh, it's Sivana colors. Champagne. Wine champagne. I live in a bungalow. Love Kush, Sonakshi, Habro are the assholes after my life. Love Kush, Sonakshi and Shatrugan, right? Habro is Shatrugan, right? Or Malaika. Ma'am, please share skincare routine. I'll put up a tutorial, darling. The way I did for nail art, I'll do that as well. Pooja Sonakshi is saying she also will do a biopic in the main lead. She's aping you again. She's a fucking cunt. She's just trying to provoke me. She's just trying to insinuate me. That's it. She gets pleasure in poking me. So isn't it obvious she's the one who assaulted me yesterday? Because I'm finally being myself, speaking in English, being myself, dressing like who I am, doing the makeup, looking good, speaking well. Getting back to who I was before I entered that wretched Kamathipura of a father in 2005, along with Salim and Vian Dhut. Dabang 3. Bhai, 300 crore aram se bhautik. Bhautik ka kya matlab hota hai? Salman Khan, Moga Aurat. It means Chakka Hijra Yunak. तेरे को भी दबंग का पिक्चर में डाल देना चाहिए सलमान खान के साथ वहां पर तो अपना राज जमाए बैठी है ना सुनाक्षी अरबाज खान होता तो उसने मुझे फिर भी बुलाया था प्रभु देवा बैठाया है इस बार क्योंकि प्रभु देवा आ, ना उसका देवा को डायरेक्टर रखा है 